Relief throughout the Triangle and Central North Carolina as our risk for severe weather eased throughout the day and evening. But the impact of that system is still being felt with deadly effects in other states, especially Tennessee. Nancy Chen has the story. This weekend, flooding swamp Tennessee, water washing across streets, leaving a school bus submerged and cars floating. In Nashville, the second largest two day rainfall on record. Emergency crews rescuing more than 250 people from vehicles, apartments, and houses overnight into Sunday morning. We have about 251 incidents. Uh, it took 600 of our fire personnel to respond to these events. A man seen pulling a woman from her submerged car. The same system sent at least 15 reported tornadoes across four states. One possible twister recorded here crossing the Mississippi River. The destruction swift and severe. Roofs sheared off, neighborhoods flattened, trees slicing through homes. I really was thanking God that we was all okay from the situation, especially after seeing the house. It comes just two days after a separate system hit noon in Georgia, where volunteers are now finding places for displaced people to stay. It's only the 10th EF4 tornado to hit the state in 70 years. Georgia Governor Brian Kemp. Just total destruction in many places. As quickly as a tornado struck, the cleanup begins as crews remove trees, branches, and debris. That same storm system is now moving up into the mid Atlantic states with a lower tornado risk, but strong wind gusts still packing a punch. Nancy Chen, CBS News, New York.